Today I'm here to show you the Stable Compact, the do's and don'ts on wiring. As you can see, there's a positive and a negative. You need to make sure you wire this correctly every time. If you don't, the horn will sound absolutely terrible. So the correct way the horn will sound And if you wire it incorrectly, the horn will sound like. When wiring and testing your steeple, always ensure that you have nice, firm terminals. One of our most common faults that we find with customers is that they have a loose terminal and it's not getting the correct voltage to the horn. All steeple horns come with a, a relay that must be used at all times. If you're not confident with wiring or don't know how to wire, we have available a wiring kit and diagram on how to wire. All steeple horns come with a mounting bracket and bolt in the kit so you can mount it to where it's necessary. Another thing you need to ensure is make sure the horn is facing down. The reason you need to face this down is water can get trapped or go in and ruin the compressor. So when mounting, always ensure that it's facing down. In the kit also is available is the breather pipe for the compressor. You need to make sure this is installed and also get a bit of clear hose and put it as a highest point possible so it can't suck in any water or dust or dirt. If horn stops working or starts making different noises than normal, we suggest if you pull off your breather pipe, find an air compressor with a gun, clear out your tube. When cleaning the horn, you want to spray compressed air down this vent and also into these vents here.